It appears to have been a freak accident, as a passenger-loaded car on the Revolution ride was slowing and moving into the passenger boarding area. An employee tried to cross the tracks. The car struck her. The name of the female employee at Six Flags who was killed here at uh, the Revolution is Sherry Lamont. When word of the tragedy spread through the park, fellow employees were shocked. I'm sad, you know, because I'm a ride operator myself, so I work at Viper, and, you know, and I know a lot of people where that work at Revolution, and that just makes me feel sad as one of my own co-workers. It's very sad. I, I can't believe it happened. It's, it's unheard of. The Revolution ride was immediately closed, and Los Angeles Sheriff's homicide detectives began piecing together the events that led to the death. Right now, they're, they're talking to witnesses, they're looking over the area, and they're trying to gather all the facts to determine exactly what happened. Officials at Magic Mountain say Sherry Lamont was 25 years old and a two-year employee. Lamont was a certified ride operator and had been on the Revolution for about a year. The president of Six Flags Magic Mountain says employees are taught never to cross the tracks. Now they're looking at ways to retrain ride operators. We don't know why she decided to step out onto the track and exactly why. But our deepest sympathies goes out to family and friends. The Revolution Ride is closed for the official investigation, and there will be an internal investigation as well, we're told. As park officials say, they'll work to see what other precautions can be taken to keep employees safe.